Hi, my friend. Welcome back to our reading class. Hi, my friend. Welcome back to our reading class with Mr. Nita. I am so happy to have you here today. In today's class, we are going to practice how to spell words with split a digraph in them. The letter sound we learned yesterday. Okay, name that picture. What is that? Yes, it's a cake. It's a cake. Okay, let's count the sounds we hear in the word cake. Let's go. K, A, K, cake. We hear three sounds. Yes, friends, there are more letters in the word cake, but we care about the sounds we hear because when we are spelling, we spell with sounds. Okay, get your objects. Let's count. First sound, k. Next sound, a. Ending sound, k. Let's go. K, a, k. Kek. Three sounds, okay. Let us write down those letter sounds. Mm -hmm. First sound, k. We know that letter C makes the sound k. So we write it. Next sound, A. Ah, if we hear A, we know that C and A moves with the letters. No, we know that letter C moves with the letters, with letters A, O, U. So if we are hearing A here, what does that tell us? It means A is having her best friend at the end, which is letter E. Okay, like that. K, A. What's the ending sound? K. A, K, cake. Why are we using K at the end, not letter C? Because C also makes K. It's because K moves with the letters E or I. I don't know if you remember that spelling rule, if I've told you that spelling rule. Okay. All right. Good job. What if I wanted to write the word safe? Safe. It is safe to stay with Mr. Nitsa. Let us sound it out. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. A Sef. Good. Okay. First sound. S. Next sound. A. When we hear A, what does that tell us? It means there is a bossy E or the magic E at the end. Okay, let's go. S. A. What's the ending sound? So the F sits in between like that all right so that's what you're going to do in your spelling activity today you are going to write you are going to spell and write words having the split digraph a in them let me see which words are you spelling today great all right you are going to spell words having a sound in them okay you are doing lesson 26 remember to use your counting blocks to do that all right Okay, pause the video and have a go at your spelling task. Once you are done, you are going to keep your workbook in a safe place because tomorrow we are learning a new split digraph.